Hi guys, welcome back to another colorful keto with Dory. I received an amazing gift from Joette and she sent me a keto brick to try out and to experiment with. I used two tablespoons of sugar-free chocolate chips. I'm using Krista chips today. I pop those in the microwave to melt. We're gonna use my awesome unicorn molds today. And I have a super secret ingredient that we're gonna work with. We're going to use my non-toxic luster dust today in silver, gold, and in copper. The teeniest little bit of sparkle, and I'm going to coat the bottom of our molds with the colors. This is what our mold looks like with our metal luster dust in there, our metallic look. So I'm just going to spoon a little bit of the chocolate into each of my molds. It works out to about a half of a teaspoon per little chocolate. I pop this layer into the freezer to quick chill and we're going to talk about the keto brick. Okay, I had very low expectations. I, I don't care for protein bars very much. I find that they tend to have a very chalky protein kind of flavor to them so i'm really excited that joette sent me this because it's not something i probably would have tried on my own because i don't generally eat protein products but i was really really pleased with this one now the first thing i want to talk to you guys about is the texture it's got a very light flaky texture similar to a hulva if you know what hulva is. And I really love that it doesn't have any protein aftertaste. I, I was shocked, like it's light. It's got some nice, a little bit of crunch in there with the cocoa nibs. Very, very nice. I'm really happy with this product. The ingredients are very, very clean. It's really low in carbs and it's shelf stable. That means you don't need to refrigerate it. So if you're doing things like hiking or camping, it's amazing for that. So the ingredients in this is raw organic cocoa butter, plant-based protein powder, natural chocolate mocha flavor, cocoa, stevia extract, and um, a gum blend. It's a cognac gum blend to thicken it. And then it's got sea salt, monk fruit extract. And then a digestol, which is a vegan enzyme blend, MCT oil powder, golden flaxseed meal, raw organic fermented cocoa nibs, coffee beans, and Himalayan salt. All yummy good stuff. Take about two to three tablespoons of the keto brick. I'm going to pop it in the microwave for 30 seconds to get it all melted. And we're just going to spoon about a half of a teaspoon on top. I'm going to finish these up. I'm going to, I think, throw a couple cocoa nibs on the back of them to give it an extra layer. And I will get these ones all chilled. And I will take some pictures for you guys. I just wanted to pop in and let you know how much I absolutely love my keto brick. If you guys get a chance to try it, I can't recommend it highly enough. It is amazing, it's delicious, and I think it's a really great solution if we're on the go.